Good afternoon and welcome to Weekly Update. I'm Asahi Osage here to bring you all the news storming the headlines this week. This week kicked off with a, yes, wait, no, no, are you serious? On Monday, when the University of North Carolina and Villanova competed for the NCAA championship, Villanova ended up taking the title after a last second buzzer beater, leaving many fans emotionally distressed, including the one friend who had to leave the building to relax, but never came back until you had to get on TV and personally plead for him to return. Please, Casey, come back. Season's over, rent is due. They don't pay me enough for this. The biggest leak in investigative journalism history has been in progress this week with the anonymous release of the Panama Papers, stocked with over two terabytes worth of confidential information, which is what I told the IT department when I sent in my laptop to get fixed without clearing my internet history. And they still look through it. God, so nosy. You know who else is nosy? The girl who says no more than two words in the conversation. Hey, how's it going? Hey. So what's going on? Not much. So uh, nothing happened to you lately? I guess. What do you mean you guess? You, you guess what? Something happened. OK, so then what happened? Stuff. OK, conversations in general have to require some specifics. So could you please give me some actual information? Yeah. OK, so. What do you have? Nothing much. Not much? Of course, of course, of course you don't have much. How could I be so naive? Is every conversation with you this painfully dry? Not sure. Not sure. What? Girl, who says more than, no more than two words, everyone. Get off my stage. Thank you. United flight attendant activated the emergency slide in a packed plane that landed in Houston on Monday. Witnesses say they knew something was up when they saw her leave in a bathing suit carrying nothing but a gallon of soap and water, saying, quote, peace out. And in news that doesn't surprise anybody but also isn't about Donald Trump, Azalea Banks did what she does best on Wednesday when she lashed out at Sarah Palin on Twitter in response to a fake article Banks thought was real. Palin returned comment with, wait. You thought it was real, too? And here to participate in some loosely related election talk is Dan. How are you feeling today, Dan? Hi. I I've been uh, really, really relaxed lately. And I, I don't know. I'm just, like, super hungry. I can see that. I can see that. So you're a political expert, right? And so how are you feeling about the election so far? <laughs> You know what's so funny, man? All of these candidates are just like cartoon characters. You got the old cranky screaming guy who says God knows what. And then this guy that just says crazy things. And then you have the grandma, and you have the Catholic, and then that random guy who just shows up whenever he wants to show up. Wait, who's the last person supposed to be? Are you, uh... Dan, are you going to answer my question, or uh, are those chips keeping you busy? Uh, oh, what? Wait, what? The last guy that you mentioned. Who was that supposed to be? Oh, uh, oh, John Kasich. Everybody forgets about him. I, I forget about him a lot. Yeah, I can tell. Um, so you've been following this election pretty closely. So who do you think will take it all in November? Uh, um, um, man, that takes uh, some time to give a good answer, because this right, this this race is just something you never see in years, but uh, I think it's going to be Br Bernie or Trump. Bernie or Trump, not Hillary? Oh, no, 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 Because if it is Hillary, Bernie will not like that. He's just going to get all cranky and yell at all the people. Like, we're just going to be like, have it. Oh, you don't know what you're talking about. Dan, everybody! A study shows that sleep rooms are predicted to be the newest office addition and will help, quote, enhance performance. So what's next in improving office performance? Mini bars, million dollar wage increases, a different type of performance enhancement? The possibilities are endless, people. I could keep going. A seller in Oklahoma put up a Craigslist ad on Tuesday selling a laughing doll for $1. The description read, quote, our daughter doesn't want it anymore. 
Our dog won't stop barking at it, and we never find it where we left it. Doll has really cute laugh, no batteries. As a bonus, she makes you pee. That's it for a weekly update. I'm Asohi Usagi, and have a fantastic week.